Pitbull saves young girl from falling off deadly 60-foot cliff. A 14-year-old girl would have fallen off a 60-foot cliff to her death. Were it not for a quick-thinking Staffordshire Bull Terrier named Max. Max sensed something wasn't right, and ran away from owner George Connor, 46, to investigate a cliffside near Sussex. The spot has been home to several suicides over the last few years, so Connor knew something could be amiss. He had no idea what Max was anxious about. Being the nosy guy that he is, he started whining and pulling on his lead, Connor told the Daily Mail. I could see a shape and thought it might be some rubbish, but when we got closer I saw someone was sitting up there on the cliff ledge. Max refused to leave the young girl's side until police arrived to help. It's unknown how long the young girl had been sitting near the cliffside, but the effects hypothermia had begun to set in. The officers went over to the cliff edge and tried to get her attention but she wasn't moving. So they decided to pull her through the fence and away from the edge, Connor said. She wasn't really coherent. It looked like she was suffering from hypothermia and the police said her eyes were rolling back into her head. It looked like she was suffering from hypothermia and the police said her eyes were rolling back into her head. It's anyone's guess how long she had been up there. She was sitting on a part of the cliff where, if she had passed out and fallen, she would have died. The girl was taken to the Royal Sussex County Hospital for treatment, and is expected to make a recovery. Connor thinks all the thanks belongs to Max, who he has owned since the dog was just six months old. A police officer came up to me and said, you've saved her life, but I said, no I didn't, it was Max who found her, Connor said. Now six years old, Max is just as vigilant as ever. He's got a great temperament and is a very friendly dog who is always ten steps ahead of the game, Connor said. If I'm ever ill he always notices. I don't know if I would have found her without him.